So ASM actually uh, has opened a sales and service subsidiary in South Africa two years ago already. And we have uh, now opened this factory here where we produce central inverters, uh, which you see behind me, for utility scale applications. First of all, we decided, SMA decided that we should have a location in South Africa to cater for the local content requirements and to participate in this market. And then, yeah, obviously we looked at uh, Durban, at uh, PE, at uh, the Joburg area and Cape Town. But Cape Town has a, 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 a green energy hub, basically. There's a cluster, there's uh, proximity to the uh, procurement or the supply chain. And yeah, it has a harbor. So we ship uh, components in from Germany. So there, is, uh, there are some very good reasons for, uh, for placing the factory in Cape Town. And uh, so you're seeing a conglomeration of various kinds of suppliers, manufacturers, sort of migrating towards the region because of the opportunity that's, that's out there. I think becoming much more cost effective. Um, so we're starting to see renewable energy coming into the system with a seven year payback and sometimes even less. Um, and if you see what's happened in Europe, I mean, uh, you know, we've got so much more sun, so it does make a lot of sense in the solar space. Whether it's wind, solar, renewable biomass, we've had uh, bakeries turning to biomass for their, for their steam production. So we, I think it's also consciousness. We, we see companies looking at what's happening from their energy supply, looking at cost of energy within our region, and then also uh, I think consumers looking for where is the bottom line? Are, are the, are the company that I'm buying from, are they conscious of our planet? And, and so it all kind of links it together, and so it makes good market sense. It is about um, us creating the right environment to attract investors, um, and sometimes even a regulatory environment that says let's have certain percentages of procurement, uh, coming from local manufacture, but we also need to get into that space where it's cost-effective, competitive, and it makes uh, economic sense. And I think um, you know things are changing in Africa very, very fast. Seven of the top ten fastest-growing economies in Africa. So I think a lot of companies are looking at Africa, and specifically we projecting that from the Western Cape. This is a place to invest, so that local procurement plays a role, but it also let's make financial sense.